that um, we have not yet seen the same kinds of energy and turnout in all quarters of our neighborhoods and communities as we saw when I was running. Now, I also want to say that that seems to be more pronounced with the brothers. So if you don't mind, just for a second, I'm going to speak to y'all directly and say that when you have a choice that is this clean, <clears throat> when on the one hand you have somebody who grew up like you, knows you, went to college with you, understands the struggles and pain and joy that comes from those experiences. He's had to work harder and do more and overcome and achieves the second highest office Man, if you want to sit your biscuit head ass down somewhere, goofy looking motherfucker, like slender man looking motherfucking ass, like anybody trying to listen to you, bro, you didn't get the memo, the community ain't fucking with you, dog. We ain't fucking with you. We ain't got two words for you. It, yes, we do. High and by. We are not fucking with you, B.O. Like, no, bro. They're going to send your ass to the community like, oh, let me go ahead and chastise the black man. No fucking, what? No. We are not fucking with you. We're not, and, and just for that, they sent Magic Johnson. They send yo ass. Oh, and don't forget, uh, uh, Sassy, uh, Martin, DL Hughley, Ricky Smiley. Like, like, the list goes on and on. Like, really, bro? Al Sharpton, that old, old snitching ass, he ain't nothing but a rat. Who's next? We ain't fucking with none of y'all. None of you guys represent a real black American man. Not one of y'all. If anything, y'all represent what it means to be a goddamn sellout. Peace. Sorry, Obama. I'm a black man, and I'm voting for Donald Trump for president, and there is no amount of lecturing or bullying or shaming that you can do that is going to make me change that decision. I am not afraid to vote for Kamala Harris because she is a woman. I refuse to vote for Kamala Harris because she has spent the last four years destroying this country. She has spent the last four years throwing up the, the borders um, to illegal immigrants. She has spent the last four years destroying this economy. We have seen over the past couple of months that she is not fit to be president. She can barely speak. She can't articulate a vision. And actually, she's pretty stupid. And if you think that I, as a black man, am going to let that waltz into the White House, that that is going to get my vote because you're lecturing me and you're bullying me, and you may be the surrogate black dad for a lot of fatherless black boys that are running around this country, but I got a dad, I know who he is, and it ain't you. I'm voting for Donald Trump for president. Take it or leave it. Sorry, Obama.